Riverside makes it easy to conduct virtual panel discussions with multiple guests and even stream the panel live across your social media platforms. Plus, whether you pre-record or broadcast your panel, you get high-quality, separate video recordings of each guest to produce later. And before we jump into all those features for panel discussions, go ahead and subscribe to the Riverside YouTube channel and hit that bell icon so you don't miss a video. The experience for your guest speakers is easy to set up, with no application to download on their computer. Once you create a Riverside Studio, just send panelists your guest link, and they can participate using Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge web browsers. Before they enter the studio, they will be able to choose the mic input, camera, and speakers. But a great feature of Riverside is you as the host will be able to see which devices they are using. And if any choose built-in computer speakers by accident, you can have them change inputs before the recording starts. On a Riverside Teams plan, you can even change the audio input and output for each guest, and they don't have to worry about adjusting any settings. As always, we encourage everyone in the recording to use a pair of wired headphones to cut down on echo and audio bleed across tracks. If you have a panelist that is away from computer or traveling, have them download the Riverside app ahead of time on their iPhone, iPad, or Android phone, and they can participate using the app as well. When it comes to a panel discussion, crosstalk can be a challenge. Expecting everyone to manage their mute button when not speaking may not be reasonable, but Riverside has a special feature called producer mode that can make a big difference. Invite someone to be a producer during the panel discussion. That person won't be seen or recorded, but is able to manage each participant's audio settings, they can share their screen, or play audio and video files from the media board all behind the scenes. The producer can also jump in and address everyone on camera for instructions or technical help, and then turn off their camera and mic right after. During the presentation, each guest will have the ability to share their screen for visual aids or slide presentations, but they can also send you, the host, media files ahead of time and you can preload them into the media board for easy playback. If your panel discussion will be open for questions, you can utilize Riverside's audience mode with live call-in feature. This will allow you to preview a live viewer's question and text, admit them into the recording to participate with video and audio, and then you can remove them once they're done asking their question. You also get separate video and audio recordings for every live call-in participant, so you can edit them later. Once you're done recording, you will have access to high-quality video and audio files for each guest isolated, and ready to import into the video editor of your choice. But if you'd like a quick way to export a finished video in just a few minutes, jump into the Riverside Editor. Riverside has all the tools you need to broadcast or record an engaging panel discussion with producer roles, audience mode, and an easy joining process for your guests. If you'd like to learn more, subscribe to the Riverside YouTube channel and hit that bell icon so you don't miss a video. And if you have questions about what we talked about, leave a comment below this video. We'd love to answer you there. On the channel, we have using video switchers, the best USB mics, and recording on the road with a mobile device. Thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you in the next video.